Hey YouTube, it's Aaliyah. Welcome to her back to my channel. So today I have a ginormous haul for you guys and I'm so excited to show you guys all these items because the ones I've already worn so far, not too many, but the ones I've worn so far fit perfect. Like these photo reviews are really helping a girl out. That's all I gotta say. But I got stuff from Shein and Fashion Nova and that includes jewelry, accessories, clothing, shoes, like the whole package, okay? But my excuse is that I'm on a trip right now, so I had to pop off, you know what I'm saying? I will be naming every item that I'll be showing you guys and if you guys have any questions on like sizing or like extra stuff I didn't mention in the video, just comment down below. I like all my comments and I read all of them. I'll reply to you the good stuff. So to like speak generally, I'm mostly a size medium in Shein and small in Fashion Nova. Let's get with the video. When I'm with my shawty, we be thugging now. We in your city, we be one now. You don't want no problem, you don't want no war. How you told me now you got me, but you switching off. Okay, so the first accessory I have from Shein is this floral embroidery shoulder bag. And this is what it looks like. It looks exactly like the picture in my opinion. The little zipper has a small gold circle on it and the handles are gold as well. She's a bit see-through, which I like. So if you have like a cute wallet, it's gonna show it a little bit. But the detailing is super nicely done. It's like stitched in there, but there's no fabric like sticking out or nothing. I love her and I got her for $4.22. Just have to say that, okay? So the next bag I have is the minimalist zip up baguette bag in light blue. I know y'all have probably seen this everywhere. They have these in like almost every color possible, but I just love this color and I think it looks cute with some fits, you know? She's cute. The size is perfect as well, zipper works fine, all that. And it did not come with a smell, thank the heavens, because I've gotten some bags that came with a smell, okay? A little stank, a little stank, stank. That almost splashed, y'all, all oh, my bad. Now for the glasses, okay? I got two glasses from them, and I've been wanting to get glasses ever since I seen these Instagram baddies popping off with them and tagging Sheen. I was like, what? So first of all, let me point out that they come in these cute little bags. It says Sheen on it. And it's a little clip <laughs> and they all come with i assume they all come with the little lens cleaner white thingy so this one is the square rimless sunglasses this is what it looks like they're so 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 cute i like how they give like vintage vibes you know and this is what it looks on <gasps> not trying to ruin my makeup but i have to show y'all y'all see that yeah, y'all see that? Ooh, I love it. And the next pair is the acrylic frame sunglasses. I just got them in plain black and it's these ones. I know y'all have seen these before. Oh, this is what it looks like on. Pretty cute, you know what I'm saying? I love them. I know some of y'all don't support fast fashion. Don't hate me too much, okay? I just like saving money. But that might be selfish thoughts. Okay, let's move on. Now I'm moving on to the jewelry that I got. So as I said, I'm on a vacation and all these got shipped to my house. So they went through the planes and all that. And a few of them got a bit tangled, okay? Like I received the package and then I put them in the suitcase. So I apologize. But they did not come like that. It is not Shane's fault. It was in pretty packaging. I just took it out of the packaging and pitched it in my bag. That was the Angel Decor layered necklace. See, like it's a layered necklace. They don't come separate. It's just one big like, fat necklace. So to the tangle, it's a bit hard. No, okay, not my fault. The rest are fine. Let me move on to those. So next I have... This four piece rose and dragon charm necklace. So it might just be my neck or how I place them, but they're honestly like all the same size. So when I wear them, I don't wear them together because I like it when it's like actually layered, like short, long, you know. But this is it. And guess the price $2. So the next three necklaces actually came in sets. 
but I cannot seem to find them. There's actually only one missing from this one, and it is called the Three Piece Coin Fur Pearl Decor Necklace. Got it for $169, and it is this. It's some charms in this little pendant here, and then this chain with the little pearl on it. Super, super cute. I love it. Now I'm gonna move on to the three pairs of shoes that I got from Shein, and then we're gonna get on with the clothes. Okay, so first pair of shoes I got are actually slippers because I love slippers, and I'm literally staying in a hotel for a month, so I needed some slippers to walk around in that I have not been wearing at my house for months, okay? So they're these white, fluffy, open toe slippers, and I got them in the Euro size 39. I was expecting them to be more comfortable and they also are too small for me. So these are the slippers and they feel like cardboard a little bit. Like. <sighs> I was so excited for them. And I was also expecting the inside to be fluffy too, but it's this like cardboard material, you know? So yeah, that was a no. But the two others are dubbed, so just wait on those. So I got two pairs of heels. The first one is the faux leather strappy open toe block heels in size 039 as well. These are what they look like. They're not too high. And the material is actually pretty good, I find. And to tie them, you literally just clip it on like this. So simple, so easy. I love them. And last pair of heels from Shein. You guys already know I had to get me my clear heels because I did not own them until now. Um, they're called the Clear Pyramid Heeled Mules, size 039 as well. This is what they look like. This is a tip, the little pyramid they're talking about, shaped like so. The strap is like thick plastic, but it is not uncomfortable. Like it just sits on top of your foot. And I'm so happy I got them and I cannot wear to wear them. So since I'm already wearing it to start off the video, I'm just gonna explain this piece to you guys first. So this is the one piece satin contrast lace belted night robe in a size medium. So the only thing I don't like about this is that since my waist isn't as small as like beauty standards, you know, um, it opens up a lot and like this whole video so far i've been like fixing myself so i don't flash you guys but yeah that's the only down part on this thing but i love the lace detailing and it looks exactly like the pictures super silky and it's gone through the wash like twice already so that shows that it is some good material and it ends like right here right above the knee almost pretty cute so this next piece i got is this two-piece set lounge fit and it is called Kangaroo Pocket Thermal Drawstring Hoodie and Sweatpants. And I got this in a size medium. They did come in other colors, but I just love the pink. And I was not expecting the material to be this nice. Like, it is so comfortable, so warm, like, and fluffy on the inside. The pants have a drawstring so you can tighten it, and it's not one of those fake drawstrings. It actually works. They're not see-through. The pockets are a bit, like, woozy, like the ones that show if you don't like fix them. But other than that, super cute. I love it. This was actually one of the first things I wore because I love loungewear. But yeah, super cute. And the ankles like scrunch up a little bit. Yeah. Next bit. So I just paired these together for the sake of the video. But um, I'm wearing this solid flare leg pants in size small. And like they fit my thighs and the bottom is flared so they fit. But like my waist, it is a bit small on it. You know, like my hips, it doesn't zip up all the way. So I guess I should have gotten a medium. But that's my bag. This is what the back looks like. You can see it doesn't zip up all the way. And it is flared. But the top I got on is the bishop sleeve button up cardigan in a size medium. I love the color on me and I'm not wearing a bra. But I would probably like unbutton the first one or something, you know, and just let it open up a little bit, like maybe off the shoulder type look. But it is super cute. I love the color. And yeah, definitely recommend. It's not like the itchy knitted material. It's actually soft and pretty decent. So now, this is a bit wrinkly. She's been to the wash. I have worn her, but it is the solid round neck top and biker shorts set so i got this in a small but it's fine i was thinking of like how the biker shorts would fit me since the shirt is already oversized but um the color i got it in was coffee brown 
I was expecting it to be like a dark mocha brown, but maybe I just picked the wrong color. She's cute though. I love it. This is the back. Like it fits good. I like it. It's just, I was expecting a different color, but I'm definitely going to be getting these and other colors, I think. Yeah. So next, I have this oversized skeleton graphic tee. This is in a size medium and I love it. Like you can feel the sticker thing on it, but other than that, I love it. The sizing is perfect. It is oversized and I like that it's oversized and the sleeve doesn't end here because some of them end there. Like the sleeves are tight, but it's just extra long and baggy. But this isn't the case. Super cute. And also, I paired them with these biker shorts that I've wanted for the longest time. Like there's just so many ways you can pair it and I like that it has a little extra kick to it, you know? There are the lace hem biker shorts and I got them in a medium. You see the lace right here? I love it. So, so, so cute. It just adds a little kick to the fit, you know what I'm saying? It's just sexy, you know? Like, it's super nice. And for my short torso baddies like me, um, these are ultra high-waisted. So if y'all wanted to wear, like, a crop top with it, I wish you luck because it goes, like, right under my titties. It's like we're gonna have no stomach showing, okay? Just a little heads up for y'all. I got the same shorts on, but I wanted to show you guys this sweater. It is this angel and leather graphic oversized thermal sweater. And I got it in the large because I looked at the reviews and it did not seem oversized. Like people my size were getting a size small and it literally fit like a tight crew neck. So got it in the large. I'm really happy with my decision. The arms are baggy, a little long, which I like because I have extremely long arms. Um, but it is super, super warm and fluffy, like, I'm hot right now. But this is the little design on it. It says Angel Baby. Super, super cute. But yeah, for the price, it's a super comfy sweater. So the next top I got is this solid crisscross tie back top in a size medium. And I am in love with it. I love how these straps are thicker, so it adds, like, a little bit more coverage to your stomach. But at the same time, you still look good as Wow. I love the color on me, the army green, it's just super cute. And it is a tie back top, so like you can make different designs with this, you can put it all up, like there's just so many things you can do. And I just love this top a lot. Also the material is pretty silky in my opinion, like it's super soft on the skin, not itchy at all. So the top I'm wearing right now is the crisscross hem solid crop knit top. And I got it in a size medium and like you just tie up these strings and it is extremely cropped, okay? Like my girlies are about to explode and if I jump, the top will go from here to here. Just saying. I actually love this top a lot and I'd say the material isn't as comfortable. Like if you have sensitive skin, it will be itchy. But um, I like the color. I just wish that it fit me better. This is the next top. It is the Scoop Neck Rib. Let me say that. It is the Scoop Neck Rib Knit Top in a size large because I looked at the reviews and I just compared my body size to those girls and thought I needed a large and I was right. So I'm wearing a bra. She is see through, sadly. I was hoping it was like a fit knitted material, but it is super thin. But can't blame it for the price. It is still cute, still wearable. Not really breathable, but I like it. It's cute. Okay, if you guys don't have this top already, go get it right now. Go get it right now. It is the seam detail split hem mesh top without bra. Okay, because there's a bra in the picture, so it's just letting y'all know that it's not included. But I got this in a medium and the color is just to die for. Um, it is mesh, completely see-through. I love these little lines. And I love the little flappy thing, whatever it's called. Collar. I'm in love with this shirt. It fits my long arms. It is so freaking cute. I cannot wait to wear this. This is the PU leather zipper back tube top. And it does have a zipper in the back and I like how snug it is. It fits good and it doesn't like fall down or nothing like. It's good. And I paired it with this drop shoulder rib knit open front cardigan in a size small. Also this is a medium, this is a small. But this material is sort of itchy but I actually like it. It looks like this in the back. Super cute. 
Don't know if I'd wear it together though, but still a good purchase. Okay, so I was hoping that these two would match a little bit, but they don't really, but I still find them both individually cute. So this skirt is the all over print skirt in a size small. It is actually pretty long. I just scrunched it up higher to make it a bit shorter because that's just how I like it. And this top is the leather graphic crop top in a size medium. And it says baby girl on it. Okay, so I'm almost done with the sheen portion. I have this dress and two more dresses and a shirt left. But this is the split detail satin cami bodycon dress in a size medium. And I'm so shook about this dress. It was literally $12 and it feels like heaven. Like it's just so cute. This is bad. But I'm actually in love with this dress and I feel super cute in it and I cannot wait to take pictures in it. So I'm too lazy to put bottoms on again because I have two more dresses after this. But this is the top. It is the space dye lace up backless knit top. And I got it in this like beige-ish color. Um, I don't feel too secure with it, like wearing it, because I'm positive that my titties are gonna come out. I'm sure I can tie it tighter. This is the back, it's a mess. I literally just threw it on, but can make it all nice and zigzag and pretty, but yeah, super cute. Alrighty, so I'm sure all of you girls have seen this dress before, especially the greenish one, because it was going around like it was a little trend for a bit. But this is the backless halter neck bodycon dress in a size medium. This is the back. Super cute, it's all open here. And I like the color on me, it's super cute, super flattering, and soft as heck. Heck, like it's worth the money. The material is extremely thin, definitely need like, definitely need like nipple covers because can't wear a bra with this, but other than that, super cute and worth the hype. So this is my last item from Shein before we move on to Fashion Nova, but this is the plaid halter neck backless mini sweater dress in a size medium. Got it for $16 and it is so flattering. It snugs your body. Once you put it on, it's like, but this is the back. And I just love it. I love the color on me. It fits super nicely. And this is a thick knitted material that I like. Now for Fashion Nova. I don't have as much stuff from there, but I have a lot of two-piece sets. Okay, y'all, don't mind my stomach. I just had a supper break because I was starving while making this video, so I'm a bit bloated, but this dress is the Simple Things in Life satin mini dress in black, size medium. This dress fits so good, and once I saw it and I saw that it had no zipper, I was stressing a little bit because I didn't want it to be too loose, but I wanted it to fit right. But y'all, it fits right. I came to wear this on a date with my mains, so I'm so excited. But yeah, love this dress, super cute, super cute. Also, it is super soft and silky, like the material is bussin'. Bussin'. So this romper is called the Second to None Romper in Brown, size small. And I love it, I already wore it and took pictures in it, but um, if you're insecure about your stomach, it does show a lot. Like right now I'm bloated, so I'm covering it a little bit, but it fits super snug and tight and it flatters your body a lot. If you got titties, it's gonna show that. But yeah, I already wore this and got hella compliments on it. This is the back, super cute. It's like cinched up on the back and on the butt, so it accentuates it a lot, but yeah. Love it. This is the original Trendsetter Velour set in black size small, okay? I'm in love with it. It is super comfy. It fits perfect. I actually have this in the light blue and I got it in the medium. It was too big for me. The pants were extremely baggy. Like, this is a small and it fits so good and snug. Like, it complements my body a lot better for sure. And the top is super comfy. I just love it a lot. So this is the same set in chocolate brown, same size. Just had to get different colors for different days, you know? The vibe's always different, don't know what I'm gonna wanna wear, but it fits so good. I'm in love. I'm probably gonna end up getting every single color they have. And they also have these in like shorts versions and I really wanna get them. Another Velour set, but um, this is their vibe collection. Like this one has a bit extraness to it. I don't know if y'all can see, but it says vibe on the butt and rhinestones. 
I hope y'all can see that. Since this was like their add-on collection to their like original Trendsetter Velour sets, the material is different in my opinion compared to the first two I just put on. Like it's a lot more stretchy and it's softer I find too. And this is a small, but the pants have a lot more room to them. And I don't know, they're just a lot softer in my opinion. But I still love all of them. So this is the last set and the last item of this entire clothing haul. So thank you guys so much for watching if you made it this far. But this is the new Trendsetter Terry set in taupe, size small. I don't know how I feel about the pants, like it's super baggy. Like I think it's supposed to be high waisted like this, but my torso is so short that it just does not look flattering on me like that. So I don't know, might need to fix the pants, but the color is cute. This is what the back looks like. Just has pockets, no like drawstring or nothing, but the top is super fitting and flattering and it just fits me like if it was a bit smaller, I think I'd suffocate. Okay guys, that is it for the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Those were a lot more items than I expected because that was a lot to try on and it took a long time to do this video. So please press the like button and that subscribe button if you want to see more of me. I love every one of you and I appreciate the support. And there's actually a lot going on in my life right now, like a lot of new big things coming, a lot of which I'm manifesting, but a lot of are actually happening to my knowledge. So I will bring you guys along the journey and hope you guys like the video. Much love. You were my bro. Yeah. Bitch, you told me now you got me how you switch your leg off.